Hi, this is Asker from Taylor and Deco. Today's video is all about motivation. You know what I used to think about motivation? I used to think like this. If you're not motivated, it's basically because you don't want it enough. But uh, in the last couple of months, I've really been digging into the topic of motivation. And I see that there is so much more to it. And I'm going to give you three key elements in this small video on how you can find motivation and really get more motivated. The first thing is do not reward yourself with materialistic things. And the reason is actually you will become less motivated, you'll become less creative. This has been shown in a lot of experiments. For instance, I read an interesting study called the candlelight experiment. And it works pretty much like this. There are two groups. One group, they give a can of light and a lot of other tools. And the task is that the participants in that group, they have to attach the candle to the wall. And they reward that, that group. Then the other group, they get exactly the same things and they also have to attach the candle to the wall. But they're not rewarded in any way. What happens is that the group that is rewarded, they're slower and they typically find less creative solutions than the other group just because they were told that they'd be, re be rewarded with money. Um, so stop rewarding yourself and other people with materialistic things. The solution is find that inner motivation why you're doing it. Start thinking about why you're doing the things you're doing might have a higher purpose. So that's trick number one. Don't pay yourself with money or others. Find intrinsic motivation. The second topic is really you should strive for autonomy. And that is why Google is so famous for their 20% rule. Actually their employees, they can work on any project related to Google 20% of the time. That is insane compared to most companies. So if you can give yourself autonomy, you will be more creative, find better solutions, and actually you will have a lot more motivation. So strive to get autonomy in your life. Maybe you can plan your work with your employees that you work in the evening, in the weekend, or some other time. Maybe you don't have to show up for the office every Monday. I don't know. Find a solution for yourself to be more autonomous. That's trick number two. Um, the third one, you probably know it, and that is master your topic. If you get good at it, it's way more fun, right? You know that. Um, if you suck at it, it's probably not that much fun. And that's why people love doing the things that they're good at, even though sometimes we should be working on things that are complicated, hard for us. But really, Get good at what you're doing and you will probably start loving it, you know. And that's why we here at Taylor and Deco are working so hard with people to show them the way that they can practice in a manner that the best people in the world are doing. You know, we're copying the strategies from the most successful people in the world and we can give you these techniques so you can master your topic. So if you're interested in being more motivated, learning strategies, to master any given topic, then contact us for a presentation, workshop, or a coaching session. Um, I wish you a wonderful day, and I'll uh, see you for some other videos soon. Bye.